Good afternoon, everybody. Wrangler here, and in, I guess, an answer to some of your requests that I cover this idiot more, we're going to deal with Tyrant Terminator Fraudit, who probably still lives on his mama's couch. I'm sorry, his grandmama's couch, and does his YouTube crap. And in this one, he's going to Wisconsin to fraud at DMVs because, well, he's trespassed from all the DMVs in the state of Illinois for stalking and harassment. So let's get this over with. Oh, with another one. Man, today we are back in the city of Kenosha, state of Wisconsin. You guys can remember, man, we had dinner investigating uh, that beating that this uh, the beating that the uh, man the young man took at Applebee's a few months ago uh, that's the first thing we want to check up on to see how is that investigation going and is it ongoing and if not if we can file a for you and... sorry to interrupt so soon but how in the holy hell is that any of your business TTA you don't live in Wisconsin it probably still is active which means that you legally have no right to it and if you're going to FOIA it, you're just doing that to waste resources of the actual taxpayers since you don't pay taxes or live in Wisconsin. Why would it be, be, why would you care about resources that are being wasted that you don't contribute to? You're an idiot and you're a loser. Get off your mama's couch. Tenant or captain or someone that I can speak with. I'll say somebody just to talk to you. What is it regarding? Um, a couple of different things I, I need to speak with. I was here a few months ago. Um, I had spoke to a lieutenant and a sergeant about it. Um, just a couple of different things. I need to speak with them real quick. It'll be real concise and brief. Okay, so it's nothing in particular that I can give them a hint? Um, no, nah, not really. Not really. Okay. Like I said, it's not nothing too um, complicated. It's just, it'll be real short, concise. And do you want to give me your name? Yeah, my name is James. James? Yeah. Okay, James, let me... He always sounds like he's at the start of an AA meeting. Yes, ma'am. I'm James, and I'm on welfare. Let me see what I can do. All right. Appreciate it. So, uh, young lady's going to go check to see if she can get a sergeant or a lieutenant or someone we can speak with. And, uh, we should definitely be good to go. The guy stays home. James? Yeah, yeah. How you doing, sir? Sergeant? Yep. Third uh, seeker. Seeker? Yeah. What's your uh, bad name, sir? 561. 561. Uh, two things real, real quick. Uh, uh, the first thing is I had came out here maybe a month or two ago. Maybe a month ago I spoke to a lieutenant about the uh, beating that the young man sustained out in Applebee's a few months ago. Obviously, okay. I was trying to fill out a FOIA request um, in terms of that, you know, regarding that, an incident. Is that Lieutenant Viola? There you go. Yes, Sergeant. That's his name. That was the one that told me to go F myself. Sorry. Short, short guy. No, not that short. Oh, my height. Oh, no, Maybe no, he was pretty, pretty taller than that. Yeah, he's short. He's a short guy. We was talking right there. Okay. Uh, but he did tell me that since it's an ongoing investigation, any FOIA requests or anything like that would be kind of, you know, yep. uh, haunting. I'll be doing some investig more investigative work on different public entities, maybe the courthouse, uh, post office, things of that nature, you know, pu public property, basically. Okay. And uh, I don't just sometimes the personnel don't like the fact that I'm filming and they're down 911. So if you guys do receive that call, just know that it's me. Okay. Yeah, you know, do, you know um, Disregard. I know guys who got. So you want him to disregard citizens of that place who are actually calling the cops because they have a known criminal who is trespassing, harassing them, possibly stalking them, who has a record for that and is under protection orders and is being disorderly. And you want them to disregard that because you have an effing YouTube channel? Dude, just how dumb are you? I just got to take the call, but it'll yeah, be me. Okay. Okay. So that, else? no, that'd be it. Um, to probably come back. Uh, is this the shift for uh, Lieutenant Viola, right? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, I probably come back and um try to you have a dialogue with him. Call? Um, no, I'll just come back. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'll just come back and see if he's available. All right. Then yep, yep. Right, so I appreciate you. Thanks a lot for meeting yeah, me. No problem. Uh, what is needed in order to like do a replacement of driver's license or state ID? Is it the same amount in terms of fee? Actually, first, you need to live in the state of Wisconsin, you effing crack baby. Um, it depends on the... Huh? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just documenting. Okay. What's your name? I'm not going to tell you that. Really? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I mean, you're, you're in public. Oh my God, she doesn't want to give you her name? Maybe that's because you're a loser or has a habit of stalking and harassing women who won't give you their name. 
Just saying. Are you doing a replacement for a lost ID or something? I'm not doing a replacement at all. I'm just trying to come in to see what's required. Okay. The thing is, I'm I'm documenting. I'm creating. A, I'm creating content for a story. Gathering content for a story. So just in case. No, you said it right the first time. You're creating content for a story. In case someone see this video, they would know uh, what's required when they come up here. So, like I said, it's not for me personally. It, it would be for anyone that uh, that Wisconsin it applies to. <laughs> there you go. Well, yeah. For Wisconsin State, yeah. There you go. Different states have different laws and different rules. That's correct. And so, um, for here, like I said, birth certificate or valid passport, or if you're not from this country, legal presence documents. Um, proof of action. You can record people that way, but not that Yeah, I, I can. I definitely can. Yeah. Well, I'm not going to document any transactions because, you know, obviously I can film wherever my eyes can see. I'm, I'm on this side of the counter, so. I actually am filming on this side. I'm standing on this side. Uh, why is that, sir? Because there are transactions taking place over here. We don't want to compromise personal. And that's what I'm saying. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm doing. Uh, sir, I'm gonna ask you one more time to film over there. And 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 I'm going. I know you're asking, and I have a have a respect. I can respectfully decline. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna respectfully decline, even though you have every lawful reason to bounce my stupid, ignorant, uneducated ass out of here. Because if I don't get drama for clickbait, Grandma gonna make me start paying rent. And so, yeah. and then I can ask you to leave if you don't abide by well, our policy, sir. Well, but that's just it. The policy doesn't apply to me, sir. Yes, it does. I don't. Yes, it does. You bloody crack, baby. It's called a limited versus a non-public forum. That is a non-public forum. It is open to the public who are there for legal services. You creating content is not a a lawful reason for you to be there. So you're loitering and trespassing for one, and second. It's called time, place, and manner restrictions, and that's not dictated by your unemployed ass. Get off your grandma's couch and go get a job, you deadbeat freeloader. I don't work here. Sir, it applies to you. No, it does not. Did anyone film? Because I can film whatever my eyes can okay, see. Okay, so I'm going to have to ask you to leave, or we're going to come I'm definitely, I'm definitely going to, well, I, I'm de that'll be unnecessary, but I'll definitely leave once I get the rest of my footage I book on out of here. I'm no, not done. Sir, you cannot film over here while transactions are... Davion said he's going to... Davion said he's going to contact law enforcement just because I'm, I'm standing where I'm standing. Yeah, that's the reason why we can do it. No, you're not. You're violating all these people. You think you, your rights are more important than the rest of these people sitting here? No. They have. Yes, sir. That's exactly what he thinks because he's a spoiled ass little brat who lives with his grandmammy who never told him no, which is why he's like 48 years old and still lives in his grandmammy's house. And TTA, dude, stop buying your shit from Huggy Bear. The same rights. Oh, you're being, you're being ridiculous. Oh, you you're being ridiculous. Uh, Why are you doing that? You're trying to cause trouble? How? Get arrested? How's it, how's it causing trouble? Shoot? Yeah. I mean, what are you doing? Why would they shoot me, sir? Crazy. Why? Why would that be? Because you're. <laughs> These people are here getting their license or whatever. They don't need you recording them. What you're doing is illegal. It's actually tell someone that's exercising their rights that they don't have. You're exercising your right. You're infringing on other people's rights. Their right to. Hey, ding, 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 ding. We have a winner. That gentleman just called you out and he hit a bullseye. That's right. You're infringing on other people's rights because you're selfish and you don't care about anybody other than yourself and not having to get a job. By the way, Tyrant Terminator Fraud, it's, do you get your hair extensions at a gas station? It's going to show up and we'll go from there. Now serving AJ. Uh, Kenosha. Hey, Kenosha PD is here. Uh, how you doing, officer? All right, what's your name and badge number, sir? That's Officer Help. Have officer Help. Thanks a lot. Hi. 
stepped away at some points and still came back near the counter such transactions were taking place. Asked them to leave earlier over how we need to call law enforcement. He refused and continued to film and here we are. Like is the refuse part. When you when you use the word refuse, it looks like you're obligated and you're shutting down something that you must do. When they use the word refuse, what I try. Okay, guys, it's time for his bullshit word salad as he tries to stay out of handcuffs. Hopefully, it goes bad. I to convey to this young man is we do have a First Amendment right to record in public, uh, publicly accessible areas. I'm not making any efforts to go past any restricted doors today. Um, his thing was me standing in a specific spot in the lobby i tried to convey to him that um whatever my eyes can see I yeah, this guy he, he's probably sauteed in a peanut right now why because unlike you and your bum ass that man has a job and a career why don't you try that why haven't you ever had a job ever why are you still living at your grandmammy's <laughs> but uh that is what it is So get a couple of more shots, man. And guys, that's where we ended it. One, I want to give an F to these officers. You're piss poor and you're pitiful. I've looked up Wisconsin and you had every right to bounce his ass out of there. And the Supreme Court of the United States would have backed you up. Shame on both of you gluttonous asses. And you, James, the reason that I had to cut the damn video like I did is because you took your little damn Dollar General cricket phone back inside and you started filming kids. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. For oh so many things. But why would you disseminate someone else's children on the internet for profit? You're disgusting and you're a piece of shit. And I can't wait till you're in prison. This is Wrangler. I'm out of here. And we'll be discussing this piece of garbage tonight on my live stream. I love y'all. Have a good one.